Before, I thought that there's nothing wrong with how childbirth is done today. In our humanitarian engineering class, we learned that there are diverse birthing practices in the Philippines that common birthing beds do not take into consideration. I and my teammates Geraldine, Eric, Tuti, and Angelo sought to provide a solution to this dilemma. We asked ourselves, how might we design a tool that helps empower mothers in labor to take charge in creating their own positive birthing experience? A maternal and newborn health technical expert we consulted convinced us to adopt the evidence-based WHO recommendation that women during labor should not be forced into any position and instead should be encouraged to take any position she finds most comfortable. As we adopted a mother-centric design philosophy, we designed Rebirth, a woman-centered birthing tool, instead of making another bed. Rebirth consists of three main parts, a C-shaped stool, a wedge, and a mat. These three together produce at least two configurations empowering mothers to choose their preferred birthing position for a positive birthing experience. Rebirth is designed to be used on any flat surface to accommodate culturally diverse birthing practices found in urban, rural, and underserved communities. To promote environmental and economic sustainability, we determined olefin fiber, polyurethane foam, and rubberized coconut coir to be the ideal locally sourced materials in the Philippines. We are building a social enterprise around Rebirth, hoping to introduce livelihood opportunities for women in its production. In addition, we hope to bring our advocacy outside the Philippines through licensing and localized manufacturing using equivalent sustainable materials. Our goal is for mothers to benefit from Rebirth, not only in our country but also abroad, as birthing occurs anywhere. With the help of the James Dyson Award, Rebirth will empower women across the globe to take charge of creating our own positive birthing experience.